Okay, today I am going to talk to you about, now get in the Wayback Machine with me here for just a couple minutes, uh, Garth Brooks on VHS. He has released four VHS tapes, and I'm going to show them to you. Okay, now, this is the first one, okay? Um, and this is the back. Now, this was released July 30th of 91. Okay, now, okay, that's not going to focus in, so I'm just going to read it to you. Okay, this contains three of Garth Brooks's music videos. The Dance, If Tomorrow Never Comes, and The Thunder Rolls. Now, at the time The Thunder Rolls was released on this VHS, this was actually the only way you could see it because the actual video that was on TV <coughs> had been banned due to domestic violence. I disagreed, but, <laughs> you know, that's just me. Um, let me see. It was banned due to domestic violence, so CMT, GAC, VH1 and MTV pulled it and refused to play it anymore. Uh, well, due to the ban. Which is really odd when you think about it because at the time of release, and it was only out for about a week, I think, before it was banned, CMT actually had it as their pick of the week video and they were playing the far out of it right up until that moment. And then they stopped playing it. So, with the release of this video, collection. This one right here. This was the only way you could see the Thunder Rolls. But the ban has since been lifted, so we can now see it on TV whenever TV chooses to play it, um, which isn't very often, but every now and then you might catch it. It can be now legally played on all video channels. Well, with the exception of YouTube, and we all know about that, so we'll just move on. Okay, the second video released was the, oh lord, it's kind of dark, you can't see it, okay, this is Garth Brooks. This was the live concert that he did on NBC. Now, this, I am so sorry about that reflection, that is horrible. Um, this video was released, let me think, um, June 16th, yeah, of 1992, and this was an awesome, awesome concert. This concert was re-released on DVD uh, later. It was in the DVD box set, The Entertainer. So you can actually get it on DVD now. Okay, now, here we go. The second collection of Garth Brooks videos. Released uh, April, let's see, April 2nd of 96, I believe it was. Now, yes, I bought it. Yes, indeed because I'm a huge Garth fan, as we all are. Okay, and this actually contains, I love the shot on the front of this, and as you can see, it has still got plastic on it. It is open, as you can see, the tape does come out. Uh, <laughs> but I never tore the plastic completely off. I love the shot of Garth at the piano, and then his face right there on the box, too. It is, it's just a beautiful shot. Um, this actually contains five videos. <coughs> Excuse me. It contains We Shall Be Free, Standing Outside the Fire, which is actually where this shot right here is from, from Standing Outside the Fire. Um, the Red Strokes, which was just genius, and we all loved it, and The Change. Now, that's only four, I know, but here's the catch. The fifth video is actually also the change, 
but there's a difference in the two. See, there's two versions of that video. One, you see Garth standing uh, in front of big old video screens singing the song. Okay, in the second version on this collection of videos, this one right here, you still hear the song, you still see the footage, but Garth is not in that video. He has edited himself out or had himself edited out. So that's the difference. The first video you see him, the second video you don't. Okay, now, then there was, oh yes, the infamous concert, Garth Live from Central Park. Now this was an amazing, amazing concert. Loved it. Okay, now this was released January 20th, I think it was, of... 1998. And let's see. Yes, uh, this was actually also re released, also in the box set in 2006, uh, the DVD box set, The Entertainer. Now, here's the thing if you have the DVD and you have the VHS, if you watch them both, you'll see. The DVD version has been edited, not a lot, just a little, but still. There is a little more stuff on the VHS than there is on the DVD, because, like I said, the DVD was edited. But there you go. That is Garth on VHS. So, there you go. Alright, bye-bye.